The lecture, which heard virtually, was an avenue to brainstorm on the various aspects of mass communication. The vice chancellor of the university, Professor Emmanuel Aluyo, who was represented by the deputy vice chancellor academics, Professor Vincent Balogu, declared the lecture open. It is on that Edo State University Uzare, and that at this university, our students graduate as at when. It is also on record that I have ranked the fourth best university in the world in times higher education impact 21 ranking in Nigeria. We are sure that our university, Edo State University, will be an academic tourist center and a destination for students going forward. The first lecture by Dr. Ayo Aye Simoju, centered on the unbundling of on mass communication program in Nigeria universities, prospects and challenges, where he said the discipline has been unbundled into several departments, which he believes is better. The second speaker, Dr. John Ogbole, who spoke on the National Broadcasting Commission and the crisis of regulating fines, implications for the industry and national security, said the agency has the right to regulate all broadcasting stations in the country as it has legal backing. Added that before a fine is imposed on any organization, such organization would have been warned with letters three times. He said there is need for media organizations to follow the Nigeria Broadcasting Code. The Dean Faculty of Arts and Management Science, Dr. Ashante Ate, the Head of Mass Communication Department, Dr. Peter Gilewa, and a lecturer in the department, Blessed Ngoso, speak on the gains of the lecture. It's a fantastic uh, event, and uh, different perspectives have been shared. I'm sure students and lecturers, uh, communication scholars all over the world, have learned one or two new things. The best way to go in the area of money of mass communication and the best way to handle the sensitive uh, um, issue of sanctions coming from NBC. Two uh, lectures we have had, one about unbundling, and uh, like you know, the Nigerian universities are in the process of unbundling MassCom to make them seven departments, and so we wanted to know more from an expert who works in that field and also the public. So we have learned a lot about that. And secondly, because we are all stakeholders in the media, not just academics, but even those of you who are working on the field, you want to be interested in knowing how you are regulated. That is why the NBC was invited, or a representative of the NBC, to speak to us about how they regulate the media so that we don't uh, guard the media, but at the same time the media is well regulated to perform its function in society. We use this platform to bring the industry into the classroom and that's number one. Number two, to keep you know interacting across board, not just um, lecturer-student relationship, also bringing people from outside to interact with our students, um, to also unveil to them what is happening in the industry other than what we are dishing out to them in the classroom. Students of the department also joined virtually in Uzarwe, Victor Odion Acha, NTA News.